Yo, what is going on everyone, and welcome to another installment of the Xfinity Series Championship Mode. So, we have a lot to do today. You guys may be wondering, Private Patton, I thought you said you weren't talking. Well, that is because I actually found some time to actually work on some stuff here. So, I am free, I am ready to do this Championship Mode race. So. Surprise, I guess. Uh, surprise stream before the actual league race tonight. Again, Fast Line Racing Series, 8 p.m. Eastern. Be here or be square. So, I will see what I can do. That will be the one with no commentary. But we are here for the Sport Clips Help a Hero 200. It is throwback weekend here at Darlington. As you can see, we are actually using Elliot Sadler's very first paint scheme that he used way back when he uh, got introduced into the Bush series back in the 90s. So, we are here using his throwback scheme. It's throwback weekend. Might as well. But, yeah, what is going on, Jesse? PFC, how is everyone doing today? I am looking to have a good race. We're starting P9. Very, very good. Here is my default setup that I'm running. I'm definitely going to have to adjust the on uh, the pressures right here as well as how tight and loose this thing is but i wanted to see how it was actually stock straight out of the uh, default the only thing i did change right here was the brake bias and front sway bar well and the tra right, track bar i guess but yeah hurdle storm what how are you doing today old school exactly that's what we're doing throwback weekend we're starting p9 let's get started so Jeff Green. Oh, no, Jeff Green. Oh, man, we have a lot of uh, engine failures and replacements going on back here. Jeremy Clements actually uh, started in the top 10, and uh, but he got relegated back to here. But now we're on the inside lane, which is perfect. So, chat, I'm having a good day. Let's make it even better by getting this uh, W. We are green for 147 laps. Of course, straight up, you know me, chat. I don't like to do stages unless I have to. So we are going straight up from start to finish. A little loose off the top, but I know that will get better as uh, we get later on throughout the run. The Cole Custer in that lovely throwback scheme. Ooh, okay. Little, little tight through three and four, but I think that's honestly the tire pressures. Yeah, we're already making a move. P7, P6. Stay on the bottom. Making our way to the front, chat. Going to give him plenty of room. Careful, still there. Yeah, giving John Hunter plenty of room, but he is using me up. And there we go. Christopher will actually tag the wall right there. All right, you're clear. What series? Um, it is the Fast Lane Racing League, which uses the cup cars. So I'll be racing at Michigan. It's going to be a 100 lapper um, with custom stages and actual uh, uh, custom cautions. So hopefully uh, you all can join me there later on tonight. But that's for later on tonight. Let's talk about uh, this awesome battle for the lead here between the top four. Tyler Reich, championship points leader, gets a terrible run. And we're... Going to try to capitalize here on the uh, inside. I uh, can't quite complete the pass. Not, not a big deal. We'll get him eventually. It's only lap three. We can't win the race on uh, lap three, but we can definitely lose it. Ooh. Got one Major choke up right one. there. No contact, but we came damn close to it. Man, it is just slicing dice over here. Also, I wish uh, that Darlington would be an actual night race for uh, for real life Xfinity. Here we are for uh, in this wonderful twilight uh, era, which is for the Cup Series. This would be like stage two time. I definitely don't want to go high. You, there is a weird seam right here that if you hit it just right, it will knock you into the wall. But what a run coming off of two. Get our Darlington stripe right there. Oh, Tyler Reck really pushing us against the wall. Allows for Christopher Bell to get on through. I'm honestly just going to let him pass. Uh, you definitely don't want to be on the inside coming into turn one. Cole Custer, what are you doing? Cole Custer being an absolute 
Uh, I don't even know how to describe that. Giving us rear end damage, 5% worth by that little escapade. All right, let's just calm it on down because you definitely don't want to be, uh, you definitely don't want to be on the outside uh, going into uh, turn one because literally the the AI don't give a crap. They literally will just throw it right in. If you watched, uh, if you've seen my um, late race uh, streams, you'll know exactly because we just did uh, Darlington last night. I would uh, oftentimes just let them go. Ooh, Allgaier, looking pretty, pretty racy here. Charging uh, turn three in order to get back to us. Okay, again, I'm just gonna let him have it. Chase Briscoe, you know what, there you go. Like, in order to not make contact with the AI, I'm just being ultra, ultra conservative. Don't worry, chat, we'll get back up there. You'll be streaming after my league race? Okay. Awesome, man. Thank you for not trying to overlap. Like I said, chat, um, in the very beginning, we can't win the race on, uh, on lap three, but we can definitely lose it. And that's how we can lose it, by getting caught up in uh, early race trouble like that. But yeah, we are fast. As soon as we get hooked on up, we are like a bullet. Uh, we are really loose, so we may actually have to tighten this thing up. But yeah, Chad, how is everyone doing today? Welcome to this surprise stream. I actually was not intending to do this uh, race tonight, but I'm glad I did. Have a good turn now. Hopefully I can uh, get a good race in for you guys. Here for Darlington, the lady in black. Still there. Throwing it down to the inside of Briscoe. Try to clear him, oh, and we do. There we go. This guy kind of parked the bus a little bit. Pulling a nice little slide job, and off we go. But yeah, how is everyone doing today? I saw that PFC uh, and uh, Jesse, you're doing all right. That's awesome, guys. Happy Friday. It's the weekend. What are you guys' plans for the weekend? Take it nice and smooth right here. I know, right? What's up, Griffins? How are you doing today? I know you're excited about be of it being Friday. You were talking all about it yesterday. Take it nice and smooth. Try to duck in right here. Careful, still there. Nice and smooth. There we go. Let that momentum take me and then park the bus in three and four. Yeah, we are really loose. We're definitely got to tighten this thing up just a smidge. It's beer and video game night. Well, I can see I already have one of those things covered. I have uh, coffee at hand, but like that's not a, that's definitely not a, uh, a beer you're choosing. What is your beer of choice, Griffins? <laughs> Her summer, right on. Her summer approves, there you go. Planning to do your race, uh, well yeah, the race that you were talking about uh, earlier this week, man? Is that what you're talking about, PFC? All right, so up in the P7, kind of, we were really charging, then we kind of fell on back, but, oh, there's that bump right there. It really made us get loose. Nice and smooth. I'll tell you what, turn four is actually our kryptonite. That is our uh, worst corner. That's where we're gonna lose a lot of time. But then again, we kind of make it up in turn two because watch this momentum just take us to Allgaier. It depends on the season. Well, right now, with it being basically spring, what's your uh, beer of choice? Like right now, what are you having now? Yeah, I definitely need to tighten up. I am loose.
You have a good truck and Xfinity car? Awesome, man. Then I would hope to see you in victory lane then. Yeah, I am massively loose. Tighten this thing up. I almost want to say like a full round. But like Letta? Did I say that? Did I pronounce that correctly? More or less a tomato beer. Well, Chad, if you know me, you know I'm not a uh, beer drinker, so... I actually don't drink alcohol at all, in case you didn't know that. Alright, cool. Yeah, battling a majorly loose race car. Right now, I'm finishing my uh, Java Porters and Dark stuff. Okay. Man, you got an entire system going, don't you, don't you, Griffins? Does your kid ever try to sneak some from you? Alright, there we go. Moving forward, almost trying to get break into the top five. With Michael Annette, who started on pole, already falling back into uh, sixth place. It makes, just makes you think that, like, with Tyler Reddick uh, and Cole Custer up there in in uh, second and third, or at least uh, second, third, fourth is Christopher Bell. We're, at, we're gonna have a tight uh, points battle after this race um, if we finish uh, up the way we are. If he does, it's in a bottle. <laughs> there you go. All right, come on, Michael on that. Stay low. Maybe I can use uh, John Jackson as a pick. Careful, still there. Yeah, there we go. That's exactly what we're looking for. Use our lap traffic to our advantage. All right, you're clear. All right, now we have all guard directly in front of us. PFC, you're going to be practicing more for the Cup Series than you are Xfinity? Well, in some people's eyes. Ooh, okay, you old guy, you're blocking. Uh, Cup Series is uh, more important, so there's that. Chat, are you guys excited for uh, the race this Sunday? Because F1 also announced that... Uh, I'm not about to go three wide. Um, I'll just follow all guy here. That uh, they're going to uh, right, run a on, virtual guys. Grand Prix series, kind of going hand in hand with uh, with NASCAR's replacement series. I'm so excited for that, honestly. Racing's back on the menu. Stay low, stay low. Give him plenty of room to Allgaier. Come on, Josh Balicki, don't go low. Oh, why are you such a butthole? I am, I swear, going high is like a death sentence. Stay low. Loose. Okay, we're good. All right, you're clear. I said it before, I'll say it again. At Darlington, traffic will make or break you. You'll either get lucky or very unlucky, depending on how uh, gracious the driver feels. Like Austin Hill, are you going high or low? On the oh my god, come on. Staying high up here. Like, that's exactly what I'm talking about. Careful, still there. Like, yeah, they just clear. go wherever they want, and mostly it's to block me. I'm excited for it too, PFC. Ooh, Austin Centric, that is not... Oh my god, what a 
ballsy move. I have never seen the AI attempt to go three wide like that before. But you know what? It, we get the momentum and see if we can get the spot back. Who is that? Justin Haley? Oh my god, that's Josh Williams. What is he actually doing up here? He's legitimately in 8th place. I know he won the, um... The, uh... The Siri, uh, the Atlanta race. Down low for iRacing. Holy god, he's legitimately up here. Come on, get up there. Careful, still there. All right, Chad, stay up there. Thank you. Did they announce what time? 1.30. Larry Mack did the announcement. All right, you're clear. Chad, I'm so excited to have Larry Mack back up in the booth. All clear. It's going to be uh, Mike Joy, Jeff Gordon, and uh, Larry Mack to call the race. Live from Fox Sports 1. Meanwhile, on the same token, ESPN is uh, going to host um, alternative sports like uh, the Mar Great Mar Marlboro One, where it's just literally, it's a YouTube channel, which I just literally uh, discovered like last week. That's devoted to literally marble racing. It's actually amazing, but that's going to be on ESPN now. We live in a time period where All right, you're clear. iRacing is, is getting national coverage and ESPN is covering marble racing. We live in a society where this is happening. Yeah, Zane Smith, stay up there. All right, you're clear. Oh, we're so loose getting off the, the final turn. Getting off turn two. All right, so Christopher Bell and Justin Allgaier are right there. Again, they're right around us in the points. We definitely cannot let them just run away with this. My lap 31. We're halfway through this... Uh, halfway through this uh, entire fuel we're on right now. Looks like we're about to be pitting for tires before... Uh, before uh, fuel... I'm okay with that, honestly. Careful, still there. All right, clear outside. Inside, clear down low. Ooh, came in a little too hot right there. Careful, Almost made there. contact. All clear. Keeping it clean, though. The only uh, contact we've Inside. made... Okay, you know what, Josh Williams? Go ahead, man. Knock him dead. The only contact we made was when literally Cole Custer destroying my rear end. And that's about it. It's a quick burp right there. Loose. Yeah, my my right sides are taking a beating right now. Yeah, I'm 100% tighten this up. Yep, COD life. I only do 100% races on Twitch, sir. That's my shtick. That's what I do. By the way, COD life, how are you doing today? Online? No. Online? No. Uh, because no one else... I would, honestly. But no one else wants to do it. Like, I could set up a lobby for 100% race for, like, Eldora. And no one would join. Because no one... No one I've seen that does online racing likes to do 100% uh, races. They want short, sweet races... Mostly at Daytona Talladega. 25% races are fine. Like, I've seen a couple of that. Uh, the highest uh, attended 
that I think people uh, like on uh, online is 13% daily. Hello. Alright, so, but yeah, welcome everyone. If you're just now popping in, welcome, welcome. This is 37 laps in to the Xfinity Help a Hero 200 at Darlington Raceway. We're gonna be ballsy here. We're gonna go three wide and pick up a position in the process. Right now, we are battling a very loose race car. The Lady in Black is a track rat. The track too tough to tame for throwback weekend here in the Xfinity Championship mode. Chat, we have five races left until the end of the season. And because of that, we have all to play for. This coming up, uh, the race coming up right after this should be the Roval? I think. What's up, Adam? How are you doing today? Let's get done with the 50% race at uh, Daytona and finish fit. Oh, what series, man? Yeah, because in the Daytona race that we just did yesterday for the truck 12 track, loose. Uh, we finished eighth. Honestly, could be better, could be worse. We have about 25 laps on fuel. Um, until uh, we are forced to pit, but I feel like we're all going to be pitting for tires before that. Yo, woo, 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 how are we doing today? Oh, I'm doing really good. Thank you for asking already, man. Take it nice and slow, get a good momentum off of two. Cut down to the inside, looking for P5 on Allgaier. He's getting massively held up by Timmy Hill, just... Take her time, take her time. Still there. All clear. Yeah, I'm doing really good, my guy. Thanks for asking. How are you doing? Just uh, doing a race to help, help on out the, uh, the stream before we actually uh, get into uh, the league race for tonight. So P5, P4 and 5 are literally right in front of us. Take it nice and slow. Ooh. Oh, we got we just got a better jump than Allgaier did. He was a little too slow getting to the inside, but we had the momentum coming off of two and we were damn well using it. You're racing at Atlanta right now, Cod Life? Nice. I do believe uh that's coming up on the schedule here for uh one of my series. I wanna say the Fantasy Five. Hmm. No. Never mind. Chad, this is a uh, two-stop race, no matter how you uh, slice it. Do we play it safe and stay out for as long as possible, or do we or do we play it risky and uh, attempt for strategy? Like pit, like here in ten laps for tires. I feel like we uh, play it safe and just go as long as possible, honestly. Still there. I mean, we have a very fast car. We're about to get into P4. All right, you're clear. Not only that, but points, uh, bigger picture here, point situation. If a caution comes out, that destroys my race. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm just going to play it safe. But just know, if strategy does present itself or an option, I will take it. But right now, we have a comfortable P5 right now. 
Yeah, PFC, I, that's what I'm thinking, is playing it safe. Yeah, I'm very loose right now. I'm definitely... Definitely think, uh... Definitely think, uh, playing it safe, but... Man, Cole Custer is gone. He has just checked on out. We have... Noah Gragson should be in, uh... Yeah, Noah Gregson, who's in P2. Tyler Reddick, who is four seconds in front of us in P3. Chris Rebell was right in front of us now, P4. Uh, there's no tire indicator. We got a really, really... Uh, watch that. We'll, we'll pit at the last possible opportunity. Still there. All right, you're clear because my rear is being destroyed, and that just shows how loose I am. When your right rear is the one that's fading more than your right front, you're loose. Oh, God, like, thank you so much for the host, man. So I'll stay up as long as possible here. Still there. Ooh, uh. Up. Yeah, I, I'm going to tighten this thing up an entire round because that's just how loose we are. Clear high, clear high. If I can make it five more laps, that'll be perfect. So, like, lap 55 is, barring anything absolutely tragic happening, I think lap 55 is, uh, is our, uh, pit-in lap chat. John Hunter, do you want to give us a little more room, please? Jesus, why are you on me going into turn one? Ugh. That's one thing I never got about the AI at Darlington. They, they are like, oof, they are something. Go easy on the tires. Go easy on the tires. Yeah, I know. I see it. I'm at 13% right now. Not that by 5% damage from Cole Custer actually uh, wiping me out in the rear end. That's not very, very good because that's more uh, time on pit road that I'm going to need to spend to repair that. Okay, kind of wool up a little bit here. Yeah, I knew Matt Mills was going to get out of the way, so I, I didn't force the issue. Uh, but I am like really starting to pulse it right now. All right. By all accounts, next lap. Because we're at 10% right now. Ooh, look, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. Yeah, next lap, next lap. I, I have to come in. I was thinking... I was thinking about, uh... Staying out a little bit... Um, a little bit more. But, uh... Yeah, it's not really working out. Alright, next... This time, this time. I see two takers already.
Nice and smooth. Slow down. Perfect. All right, yeah, we are cranking this bad boy up a full round. Help me out. Oh my god. Um, we're gonna also be uber aggressive on uh, the tire pressures. Change this to 45, and yeah, we should be good with that. How did I get into a league race? Um, well, I joined a league, and that's what's uh, and that's what's happening tonight. Thankfully, there was no additional time for uh, repairing a rear end, so perfect. Now, I wonder where this is going to put us out at. Hopefully, a caution doesn't come out, and that would absolutely destroy our race. Okay, get back, get oh, here. perfect. Uh, pit stops are happening regardless, so we were just on the uh, beginning end of that. Racing on PC. All right, awesome. Uh, PFC, nice. PC, PFC, I get it. All right, there is uh, Christopher Bell. So awesome. We came out in front. We, we actually, by pitting one lap earlier, we actually leapfrogged an uh, entire spot. It's definitely uh, tighter right now. But it feels good. It feels good to drive. Alright, let's just connect some good laps. Will I make it all the way? Oh, no. No, no, God, no. I have to stop one more time. This is... No matter how you slice it, chat... This is a two-stop race. Which we're currently slated to be pitting at like lap like 110 or something like that. Careful, still there. So we have P5. Alright, clear outside. Right behind us. Tyler Reddick, I do believe. Where is he at? It's four and a half seconds up the road. Okay, so P4. You know what? That's not too bad. How many stops is Daytona? Um, Truck Series is two. Xfinity is two. Yeah. Xfinity is two. Cup is three. What is my next track? Uh, for what race? For what series, I should say. God, life. Well, the thing is, Chad, we've also gained a little bit of time on uh, on Cole Custer. That's, so that's good. If a caution were to come out, so far, this is a 100% caution-free race. For Cup? Chicagoland. Are we even gaining on Tyler Reddick? No, actually, we're losing time to him. No, the Roval is after Chicago land. Alright, um, I'm just gonna follow Jeff Green here, honestly. Does have to be a little bit patient here. Still there. All right, come on, Jeffrey, and you got this, bud. Give him a little bumper of encouragement. Top spray, use it if you need it. Where's my league race tonight? Michigan. Still 
still there. Man, you get held up for one second All right, you're clear. the person behind you closes up so fast. NASCAR will be back in May. Well, technically, it's already back right now, Cod Life. I mean, we basically have an entire iRacing series for uh, that's going to be featuring like all of the Cup series. For all intents and purposes, it kind of is back. That could either be very good or very bad. Well, considering that these guys are, I would say, professional, they are definitely not like the people I was racing with yesterday at Michigan. Oh my god, that was awful. Um, I would say it's going to be very good. I think we're going to, I don't think we're going to win, honestly, but I know we'll have a, a solid run. I feel like I'm actually halfway decent at, at Michigan. I, I know my line. I know my lines, uh, plural. And yeah. Just gotta stick to it. Darlington Stripe it. Let's go. Race isn't official without a Darlington Stripe. Is the league race gonna be live stream? Yeah, of course. Um, I'll be streaming it. Top 10 car. Top 5 car. What time? Right, uh, 8 p.m. Ooh, Josh Blicky. Inside. Clear all around. No contact was made, but like that was scary. You can't just, huh? <sighs> can't just uh, park it on the apex right there. Still there. Brake check the corners. Clear high, bud. I have a league race at Kansas tonight, and it's the first in the playoffs. Oh, is it the uh, Coca-Cola Cup Series? Oh, yeah, we're just... I... Okay. We're good. I thought that was going to be a lot worse than, than what it was going to be. BJ McCloud? How are you up into P6? What the heck? He's legitimately in P6. What an absolute god. Absolute unit. And no, it's not a 100% race. It's not going to be 200 laps. It's going to be 100. It's 50% races. All right, Cobb, I've calmed down. Giving you a warning, my dude. Calm down. No, oh, it's another leak? Okay. Still there. Careful, still there. Okay, well Mike Harmon's up here in 18th. How the hell? Oh, Coca-Cola is doing his uh, final race. Where is that at? Tomorrow. And what time? Here. Three, three points behind from making the final four. Ah, oh, rip. Man, if only I had an Xbox, I feel like I could have did really well. Mm, we're going to force the issue here. All right, Austin Hill. Yellow Ooh, first down. caution of the race in Tyler Reddick. Oh, that's awkward. Um, should we pit here? How many people are even on the lead lap? 13? Whoa, dang. Auto club at 8. That sounds like a plan. There's 13 people on the lead lap. I don't think I pit here. Like I said, this is only a, a one more stop, and Tyler Rook's going to be on the back foot. Yeah, I think I stay out. But ch potential championship implications. Because not only that, but this also allows me to restart on the inside. And, and I'll take that any day, all, any day, all day. BJ McLeod up in the fourth. Almost 
ready. How long is my school out? Uh, currently, um, it's out until the first uh, week in April. Hold your line. Got one outside. So far. Bottom's looking good. No, oh, good run, good run. P2. You know what? BJ McCloud is just legitimately past me. All right, you know what? You know what, bud? You got this. Knock him dead. Well, I want to see BJ McCloud win this race. I also want to see Tyler Reddick and see where he's at. Do I think Jimmy Johnson will win at Dover? I don't... I think he'll win one race this year. I don't know what it's going to be, though. I don't know who's going to win what race until, like, practice sheets, honestly. Seven-time champion BJ McLeod. Yeah, that's right. He's just been holding back. He's only been using a fraction of his power. And look at Josh Williams. Josh Williams is legitimately trying to pass Christopher Bell. We have a JD Motorsports driver, BJ McLeod, and Josh Williams up here, legitimately up in the top five. No strategy. Just They were just fast. How the hell have you ever... Got one up top. Just, just craziness all around. Okay, Tyler Reddick's uh, coming, but he can't make it the rest of the way. So, it's going to be interesting if this uh, race goes green or not. Oh, good runoff, too. Still there. Use that momentum. Try to... We're going to dive it in a little deep. Ah. Peter McLeod gave us that little helpful hint. You know what? I'll, I'll be nice. I'll be nice. Let him go. Still there. Outside, outside. That, that, was, that was a little dirty that I did right there. I tried to throw it down deep, and it didn't quite work. Josh Williams, uh, Josh Williams, though, you don't get anything like that. Stay low. Car on the outside now. Currently, I'm slated to pit at, like, lap 110. Careful, Here's there. Tyler Reddick again, but he has fresh tires, so that's why he's so fast. I'm in the league. I'm racing tonight. I've uh, finished second and fourth with zero wins. Only uh, just those two races this this season so far, or? Alright. We are rocking and rolling now. We have, like, 60 to go, so if caution were to come out, we can make it the rest of the way, and we will be pitting. But yeah, we don't have any, uh, there wasn't any inclination to uh, pit right there. We couldn't have made it all the way. So we might as well just stick it on out with the rest of, uh, with the rest of the lead lappers and see how we do. Now I finished second four times. Oh! I, I see, I read, I read that as second and fourth. My apologies. Side, BJ McCloud. 
Okay, well, he just got... He, he gassed it up a lot earlier than what we would. Yeah, this car feels a lot better. A lot better than what I did the first time around. What race am I at in trucks? Atlanta. Unless you're talking about the Truck of Tomorrow series, and then uh, I am at uh, the first round of the round of 12, which is Michigan. I'll have to look. It's on their schedule. If someone can look in the down in my uh, my Twitch info, it'll, it'll let you know. Stay on the bottom. Careful, still there. Uh, BJ McLeod's not taking it no for an answer. Damn. Yeah, if someone could tell me what the uh, round of uh, 12. No way, I think we're at Dega this year. Still there. Yeah, we're at Dega. Sorry, my bad. We have one more race in uh, the round of 16. My bad. My fault. Don't listen to me. I'm a senile old man who's been quarantined for a week and have no idea what's going on. Oh, dang. I didn't know uh, your league would allow you to become a team owner like that. That's pretty cool. Looks like Tyler Reddick uh, has really started to even on out. And that's good news for all of us. All right. Like, fit time's a charm. All clear. Got a combo now. All right. Well, we did it way too hard right there. We pushed way too hard and just threw it in there. And that didn't... Yeah, I lost more time than I gained. I'll just ride around, honestly. This is fine. Oh, I also went, like, super deep. So, like, it's... It was... It wasn't so much you crossed them over, more like I took myself out. <laughs> honestly. Hey, Christopher Bell, though, is fading a little bit. I'll tell you what, though, all the championship contenders are, like, running very similar. Like, we're all in the top ten right now. We have Cole Custer, who's winning this race. Uh, Tyler Reck, current championship points leader in fourth. On an alternate strategy, because he uh, had a uh, tire failure. We have Justin Allgaier right there in eighth. Christopher Bell in ninth. And Chase Briscoe looked like he's wrap wrapping out the top ten. It's a good points battle, honestly. Like, we're all chasing down Tyler Reddick, but Tyler Reddick is just so good right now. Yeah, right now we're just getting in a, uh, getting in a groove right now. We're gonna let the, uh, track come to me. Yeah, welcome everyone in case you're just now popping in welcome this is the xfinity championship mode the surprise race before the actual league race tonight now i do just want to let you all know chat i will not be commentating during my league race tonight i'm just going to be full-on honest with you right now i'm going to be focusing so you're more than happy to come on in and watch i will not be talking though okay so but I will be live streaming it. I will be racing. I just won't be talking. Okay? Just want to let you guys know that. Alright, so. Lap 95 right now. And that is at 8... Oh, by the way. The race is at 8 p.m. tonight. Fast Lane Racing League. So, yeah. Feel free to come on out and support me. Cheer me on in chat. 
I will gladly appreciate that. All right, so massive stack up right here. Cold Cuts are trying to get past someone, it looks like. Who's that, John Jackson? That's kind of holding up the entire thing of progress. I am not doing so well. Just took that corner way too high. Oh, this is a perfect opportunity for me. Uh, which lane's moving? Bottom. Get there. Got to Got to get that before Tyler Reck fills it. Careful, there we go. There. All right, we just got to be patient. Still Not going to go three wide. Not going to force any issues. Car high. Potentially Careful. cause a, a caution. Well, that kind of just happened. I was trying to be like giving a little Careful, extra room, and that there. didn't quite work out. Josh Williams got put into the wall right there. Ooh, Noah, what are you doing? Still there. All right, well, that's how I get we get uh, P2 totally by accident. All clear. You got room. You're clear. Kind of just happened. It's okay. Yeah, exactly. Well, I mean, that entire thing was like kind of that just sort of happened. All right, so we have one more stop here. Officially, we could go another 23 more laps, but with the parity in my tires, I feel like I need... They naturally drift on up here. I was waiting for him to do that so I can still have the bottom. Clear no, Graxon's back high. through. Ooh, massive stack up. Austin Zirk's now into fourth. Alright, so 48 more laps. We all have to pit one more time. Tyler Reddick included. He can't make it the rest of the way. Alright, you're clear. What we need to do, though, is put in some fast laps. Because since we're on an alternate strategy compared right, to clear. our points leader, this could be a major points day. If this uh, strategy does not work out for him, clear high, clear high. I know. I'm just thinking big picture right now. If a caution comes out, obviously we're all pitting, and that just evens everything all on up. But I'm anticipating green flag stops, so I guess I'll wait until that mark has it. My pit window is technically already open because we all can make it the rest of the way. However, I feel like. Stops are going to start happening a little bit later, like lap 115 or later. So I'll just, I'll play it safe and wait. I'll stay out as long as I can, much like what I did last time around. Also pulling away from uh, Austin Centric and Noah Graxon. Nice. Christopher Bell moved himself into uh, the top five. Allgaier is fighting with Josh Williams. Of course he is. All right, you're clear. And Cole Custer is just flying right now. He is checked out again. We were a little condensed, and now... Ever since he's back into clean air, he's been just trucking. You got room. You're clear. I mean, to be fair, he is the real-life winner of this race because Denny Hamlin failed a uh, post-race inspection, so this gifted the win to him. But uh, I'm just saying, yeah, he is just on a whole nother level. He wasn't even listed as like being fast. He just was fast. But we still have, like, 40 more laps to go. Not even more than that. 40-plus. There's our... Higher indicator. What's up, photo? How are you doing today? Good evening to you, too.
by Stephen Light. I'll be... Be a little bit patient here. There we go. Clear high. Clear Kyle high. Life. Could be better, man. Oh, no. What's, what's going on? All right, Kyle Life. So next time uh, we do online, you can pick a track. Race the track that we're going to be racing on at. Oh my god. Tommy John Martins, what are you doing? Just got laid off a couple hours ago. Company shut down. Ah. I'm sorry to hear that. Welcome to the club. I too was laid off. But, you know, we're all here for you, man. Believe me, you're not alone in this. You're wearing out the rubber. Definitely not alone. I mean, with the whole stimulus uh, package coming out here, that should really help you out. Ugh. Okay, we're good. Oh my god, Daytona. Ugh. That's fine, Cod Life. All right, so PJ McLeod's back up in the fourth. Let's go. Yo, OSU fan, how are you doing today? All right, am I on PS4? Yes, I am, my dude. Next question, mostly uh, to come after that, is am I on controller? Yes, I am on controller. No, I do not like Daytona because, like, that's all anyone ever races, like, online. Whenever I go to join a lobby, it's always Daytona Talladega. It's a super speedway. I mean, I, I, will, I, will, I will race it, but I'm not going to like it. Whoa. Nice. That's that spot right there that, like, I was talking about. You hit it just right, and it's, it just sends you into the wall. Yeah. Hurt my right side, but it's not going to uh, cause damage or time wasted or anything like that. Alright, so when I see... Wait, wait, how am I doing? 8%? Okay. Um... I'll come down next time. Yeah, next time. I like Chicagoland, uh, Vegas, Iowa, Michigan to race. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's for you, Photo. My personal favorite track to race at. Uh, Bristol or Kansas. I actually really like Kansas. All right, this time, this time. Watch your speed, please. You gotta take care of those tires. Yeah, shut up, I know. Cod Life, you like New Hampshire? Um, Photo, you like Homestead? Ah, I don't mind either of those, honestly. New Hampshire and uh, Homestead? I don't know, I'm definitely okay with that. Oh, I'm gonna have a quick coffee break. Give me one second. What's up, Nero? Atlanta Auto Club? Well, uh, you know what? Shit. You know, it's stuff like this that I wish I could predict when a caution was going to come out literally the lap after I come on out. I mean, at least we have the lucky dog. But, 
Oh, gosh dang it, man. Mm. Gosh dang it. Alright, I gotta get out of this cam. Atlanta's so right, much fun. Coming to the green. Almost ready. Inside. And that's how we turn into a good race into a very bad one. Well, I mean, I guess technically we have 30 more laps, so, like, anything can happen. I want the bottom. I'm just not even going to attempt it. Stay low. We can still get a top 10. Still there. Stay low. Slot right in there, Ryan C. Careful, Thank you. There. Beep, beep, coming through. Careful, still there. Yeah, that's my luck, man. This happened at Bristol as well. Still there. Nah. Uh, Car on the outside now. Well, for anyone that said uh, that you like still Michigan. There. Well, you're in luck, because that's where my league race is at. Tonight. Thank you for getting out of the way. Still there. Hold your line. Got one outside. Coming through. All right, you're clear. All right, you're clear. All right, so who's in 13th here? Justin Haley, my teammate, three seconds off the lane. All right, chat. Well, we got a job to do. We can still get a top 10 from this. Our world is not over. We are still flying. But just very, very unlucky. Okay, Caesar, you want to go up a little bit? Oh my god. Give me some room. Clear high, clear high. My tires were about to uh, pop. I probably could have stayed out like one more lap, but like I was at 8% about to go down. So like, uh, I wish I, I wish I had the gift of uh, foresight. So I could have said, oh yeah, a caution is gonna come out here the next lap, but oh well. Just gotta be patient and We'll get back up there. Still there. All clear. I'm not going to go three wide because I won't be able to clear him before entrance of three. Or Garrett Smithley down here in, uh, like 23rd and 18th. Yeah, chat. What do you, Careful, let me know. What do you, there. what do you think? Do you think I'll get, uh, into the top 10 or do you think I'm going to fail miserably? That's a loaded question because we already have Justin Haley within our uh, within spitting distance. All right, clear outside. Are they on your outside? Oh my God, foot cramp. Oh my left foot. Tag out. Someone drag for me. Car outside. All right, you're clear. Uh, I was not going to get to Grey Golding in time. Careful, still there. Still there. There we go. Full cramp. You and I racing pro league now? No, that is, uh, that's just right now. Adam, you think I'm just gonna get a top, well, I mean, yeah, that's guaranteed. Yeah. You right. Chad, I like your guys' enthusiasm. 
No, well, because, like, I know you can't see me, but, like, how I'm Careful, seated, how I'm seated, I should say, wow. All clear. Um, how I'm seated is, uh, like, uh, crisscross applesauce right now, and my foot was cramping up. And yes, I did say it like a kindergartner. Don't at me. What is my craziest race? Um, probably... I have to... It was a road course of race, I know that. There was um, a race uh, back in Heat 3 where two things happened. Uh, well, two different races, I should say. There was one who was actually the Heat 3 Xfinity Championship mode here at Darlington. Cole Custer was leading the race. And... Chad, you know me. I like to think that I know the uh, AI really well. Uh, when a caution came out, they everyone pit besides Cole Custer. And I'm just like, okay, that's fine. He came out ahead of me, so I know he didn't pit. I pit as well. And then all of a sudden, he went for like 70 laps on a tank of fuel. And I'm just like, I swear to God, how did, you, how did this man do it? If he didn't pit, how did he go like 70 laps? Turns out, at the very last second... He pit, and I had no idea. So here I am, wondering, it's like, what the hell happened, you know? And that's what happened. Um, another time was also on P3, where um, I, it was also in the Xfinity Championship mode. I was racing for a championship with uh, Justin Allgaier. I was like 30 points out of uh, the lead, the championship lead. And the second to last race at Kansas, Allgaier with like, it was either at the beginning of the race or at the end of the race, blows an engine. And I'm just like, hallelujah, praise Jesus. That's what gets me in, uh, that's what actually gets me to win that title. Because after that, I had a very solid race at Homestead. He, I think he actually like won the race, but like it wasn't enough points to actually, um, to actually All gain player. up uh, on me, and that's how I went won the championship. All right, so we're gaining right now. It just took a little bit. I still say we can get into the top ten. Ross is literally right in front of us. And who is that? Justin Haley is really right in front of him. There's Brandon Jones being Brandon Jones and being a backmarker. Still there. All clear. Yeah, weirdly enough, all my craziest races, uh uh, come from Heat 3. I don't know why, but, uh, it seems like that just seems to be the case. Yeah, we are flying right now. Careful, still there. V13. All clear. Justin Haley's right in front of us. Chase Briscoe, a little ways up the road, but, you know, that's fine. Watching 1999, uh, Trans South Financial, uh, 500. Oh, nice, Darlington. I was actually watching the 92 one yesterday. Because, you know, I'm, Chad, you guys know I've been watching uh, the... Uh, I've been watching the 1992 season a lot. And I've been, like, falling in love with uh, with that entire season. I can see why Slap Shoes uh, definitely is into it. All right, PFC, have a great rest of the day. You're not even going to watch the final 10 laps, my dude? Oh, my God. Oh, well. Have a great night, my man. Alright, so we caught Justin Haley. 
And we are also tracking down Chase Briscoe. Gonna sneak under Justin here. Stay low. All right, you're clear. Clear him, kind of park the bus right here. Just Chase Briscoe. Oh, Michael and that. Okay. So we have 10 laps in order to gain uh, 10 seconds. I think we can do it. Sorry, 11 laps. Careful, still there. Nice clean pass. See you at 8. All right, All Cod Life. Here. I'll catch you later. All right, you have 10 laps, chat. 10 laps to go. There we go. Wow, that just shows how hard I'm pushing. And we are gaining, I'll say that. I'm just looking for a top 10, honestly. Because, honestly, we could have had a solid top 5, but, like, how was I supposed to know a caution was going to come out literally that lap? My tire was at, like... 8%. You know? Crap happens. Just very unlucky. But well, it looks like we have a major pack forming right now. Christopher Bell is being affected. He's being held up by Chad Fincham, it looks like. Just steam bottom. past John Jackson like he's not even All right, you're clear. like he's not even racing. He's using an Arca car and I'm using full-on 2020 Xfinity Camaro. Oh wow, Christopher Bell actually backed here to 10. Oh, now Chris Rebell back to 11th. Okay, all right, Clear all high. right. Clear high. Top 12? About to be a top 10 here soon. Chat, like I said, never count me out. We caught him. Looks like up to 8th place is right there as well. Yeah, Chad, never count me out. It is so loose right there. That entire corner. Stay on the bottom here. All right, five, five to go. go. You got room. You're clear. This is how we get P11. Still there. Uh, no, I wasn't. I wasn't about to clear him. Just kind of got to fall in behind Austin Cedric. No, not a big deal. Still there. Still P11. All clear. All right, you're clear. As long as we can set up one and two, good. We'll get a top ten right here. Kind of burp it right there. Get maximum momentum. We're gonna look to the inside. Stay on the bottom. Still there. Didn't quite have him on the exit, but you know what? Not a big deal. Not a big deal. Should be able to get him here, though. Kind of burp it, like I said. Use Matt Mills as a pick. There we go. P10. Clear high. Clear high. Got a car low now. Or so I thought. Austin Sindrick, was that really necessary? 
move me out of the way. Alright, Chad, we're not done. He wants to play hardball, I'll play hardball. Alright, chat, we have one more shot at it. This is for all the marbles. Kind of burp it right there. Good corner. Now we just gotta park it. Nothing too fancy. Nothing too fancy. And that's how we get a top 10, chat. Cole Custer won this race pretty handily, honestly. Way to dig all day for that top 10. Disappointed that... Disappointed that we weren't able to actually bring home a t solid top 5. Like, we, I know we had the car to. But we rallied back and got that top 10. I'm okay with that, honestly. All things considering. So, <laughs> oh my god, Jeffrey Earnhardt actually with seven. <gasps> Where did BJ McLeod and Josh Williams fit? BJ McLeod fifth. Josh Williams second. Oh my god. Oh, he came so close. Oh, so close, chat. Look at that. Damn. Damn it all. Crap. Oh well. Um, we have a, a bunch of the uh, top runners down here. Like I said, I know we I knew we had a faster car than that, but we just got lucky with that caution. Literally coming out that lap, I was on pit road. Thankfully, we had the lucky dog. But we rallied back. I think we had a good race. No one DNF'd, huh? surprisingly. Oh, and that moves us down to third in points, and we're tied once again. With Cole Custer this time, he is making a late season charge. So right now, mathematically speaking, we have the top five, or sorry, pardon me, top six between what, 47 points? Yeah, 47 points, top six. <coughs> oh, chat. And with four races left in the season too. Four races. Cole Custer, yeah, he was flying. But yeah, that it's weird that a top ten moves you down one spot in the standings. That, that is insane. Uh, but I guess you can't mess around with the big boys without getting bit at some point. <sighs> like four wins to our name. Four wins to our name. And we're currently P3 in points. After our second place at Road America, I mean, we're still getting good spots. We have Indianapolis next. Okay. Honestly, I'm not sure how this race is going to go. We'll see, though. But, Jet, here is the settings I was running with. As per usual, the usual stuff here. 100% uh, uh, 105 difficulty. doesn't get higher than that. 100% race length, the usual stuff around here. Strict yellow, single stage. I don't do full season because I don't do playoffs. The reason why it is the 25 track is because this is the uh, this is the season that doesn't have the playoffs into it. So yeah, <laughs> I am all about that purist life, you know. Infrequent mechanical failures, normal tire wear. Disabled, uh, draft partners, and high impact forces. Usual stuff here. Nothing too crazy. But yeah, four races remain, chat. Third in the standings, tied with Cole Custer. How is Indianapolis going to go? I don't know. I don't know. We'll see, though. 